I trust you're prepared. If so, get into position. Yep. Good to go. We'll win today. No matter what. Heck yeah! I like the confidence, but keep your heads out of the clouds. We're looking at a long battle here. <sighs> Those imps don't stand a chance! Come on. Defend your positions at all costs and step lively. Though we face just the one legion, sloppiness will still get you killed. We gotta stop those damn imps here and now. Don't let them set one foot inside the walls. Got it. There it is. The tiny nation that dared bear its fangs at the Empire. But even the runt of the litter must be brought to heel. Galdeans! Advance! Fight bravely. In the name of her ladyship! All of you. You shall not pass. Yeah, what he said. <laughs> They're running like rabbits. Apologies. We were delayed. Sorry. She was... I mean, the rune tank was having a bad morning. About time the Kessling boy arrived. Though the Dukes favors him, he will stay out of my way if he holds even a lick of sense in his head. Pay for every one of your pathetic lies. Attack! 
You chose to harbor the criminals who raided our lands. We've every right to seek justice. Just a stain on my sword! <sighs> Lieutenant, are you...? I'm fine. Get ready. Continue. Retreat! Why do these insects simply refuse to be squashed? Too bad for you. We're the most stubborn pack of fighters you'll ever face! We just need to hold out a little longer. Fight for our friends, our families, and our homes. And you will never break us! No! Of all the fool... General Chapel, sir. We... I know, damn you! Fine. We'll regroup and crush them later. Hmm. 
Maybe in another lifetime. We did it! The enemy is retreating! Well, now. I'd say we've all earned a spot of rest. And with that, the trap is sprung. What? No, it can't be! Impossible. War isn't about soldiers scrabbling at each other trying to draw blood. War is breaking your enemy's spirit. Watching their eyes widen like frightened hares before a wolf. Bringing the meek to bay. He marched his entire army from Norsfaria? But none of our intelligence gave the slightest indication. And an enemy's heart is never more vulnerable than in the moment they believe victory is at hand. That is when you reveal your greatest weapons. Overwhelming numbers and fear. Go forth, Galdeans! March as if none stand in your way! Become fear itself! This can't be happening! Damn it! Ah! We're doomed! Run for your lives! We need to get to safety! Picar! Warriors don't die like dogs. They pick themselves up off the ground. <sighs> You're right. Now come on! Emir and the other soldiers are regrouping at her ladyship's manor. Take control of the town, and do try not to embarrass me in front of the dukes. Yes, sir! Quickly! You all made it. Where's Emir? Inside. How's it looking out there? They're closing at speed. Whatever we're doing, we better do it fast. Milady, we must get you out of here. Do something! Protect her! I agree. There's no time to lose. We'll gather the remaining soldiers. Then take everyone and escape through the East Gate. What are you saying? You're coming with us, milady. Aren't you? No, I'm not. However, the distraction you create is going to help me escape. There's a secret passage by the manor that leads to safety. One of House Groom's little insurance policies. I'll use that while you make for the exit. But we should decide where we'll regroup because I haven't even begun to fight. A secret passage, is it? Well, how about that? Oh, oh, I know! We should meet at that ruined castle we found! That's perfect. There's no way the imps will be able to squeeze all their men through that mine. Good. Then it's decided. Hmm. Very good. Then we'll meet you there once we make our escape. Your ladyship. You take Jane Quiss and... <laughs> if you need a bodyguard, I am... Nope. This job's mine. I'm a strict follower of the mercenary creed, which is to stick with the person least likely to get murdered. You're not gonna make me break my creed, are ya? Wow, that's convenient. <sighs> Just take care of her. If that's settled, it's time to go. Good luck, my lady. Travel safe. You too, Emir. Uh, Noah, might we speak privately for a moment? We... 
Me? I know time is short, but I would beg a boon of you. Uh, that's like a favor, right? In the offhand chance. No, in the one in a thousand chance I don't make it out of here alive. I want you to raise an army in my place. You want me to lead the resistance? No, because in 999 possible futures, I'm doing that. I'm only asking you to cover the one slim possibility that remains. Will you do it? Okay, but why me? <sighs> I had the privilege of observing many people as I grew up. And what I came to learn is that most people in this world cannot be trusted. However, there are exceptions. Not many, and they are difficult to find, but there are trustworthy people out there all the same. I'm asking because I think you're one of them. <sighs> also, you remind me just a bit of someone I once loved. Uh-huh. Now, be gone with you. You're supposed to be my distraction, so get out there and start distracting. Yeah, mule! Whoosh. Okay, okay, I'm going. And I promise I won't let you down. Good luck, Noah. The Chatterbox returns! So, how was your talk? Where to begin? He can tell us later. Noah, I want your team to take the Vanguard, break through, and open the East Gate. I'll follow once I've assembled the troops. Understood. healer. All right, let's move. I see him! And they're here already? By the rune's guiding light? Magical girl Mavor is he don't come to get ya! Damn it! Yes! Wait, what? So... Never betrays you. Move. Move faster. The town is nearly in our grasp. General, the enemy stragglers are making a break for the East Gate. Hmm. That's where the Kessling boy is posted, isn't it? Yes, sir. 
But Lieutenant Kessling has asked us to send more troops. Nonsense. He can make do without. Begging your pardon, General. But his unit is just a few soldiers and the rune tank. From what I hear, the Dukes views Saint Kessling as a singular talent. So what, pray tell, does the Wonderkind have to fear from a few League stragglers? Have faith in the lad. How do we get through? The hard way. Hey! You're with the watch! Let's get it done! betrays you. Keep it moving, people! to the east gate yeah but look I see so no reinforcements will be coming we're all alone well that's fantastic the thing is sir General Chapel he you don't have to explain that man to me Paul get the rune tank running we'll use it as a barrack Right! Lieutenant. Sane? Is that you? Noah. <sighs> You've seen what I've seen. You know this war is unjust. I do. However, my place is in the Imperial Army, and my house's responsibilities now fall to me. Look, you've got ambitions. I understand that. But my situation's changed, and I have to leave through that gate. Noah! Lieutenant! Stand down. I cannot! need only lay down your weapon. No. I made a promise. So be it. Then my duty as an Imperial soldier is clear. Get ready, Noah. I am ready. Is he 
holding back? I'm not letting you stop us. <sighs> Surrender, Noah. This war is already over. Like hell it is. If you continue to resist, I will have to hurt you. That doesn't change a thing. Surrender! I swear on my house's honor that you and your friends will be spared. It's not happening, Sane. And if you're gonna be stubborn about it... Fine, Noah. If neither of us will bend, then we will fight till the lesser man breaks. My turn! Try me! In the name of House Kessling, I will bring you in line! Sorry, Sane, but you're not getting in my way! In the name of House Kessling, I will bring you in luck. I'm sorry, Sane, but you're not getting in my way. My turn! Try me! I'm sorry, Sane. But you're not getting in my way. Now, attack. What's next? It's over, Noah. Accepted. What about your friends up there? Damn it, Sane. Must we do this until someone dies? I made a promise, and I won't stand down. Still meddling, I see. You haven't changed at all. You will not leave this city! Fight harder, Noah! Surrender and you will be treated fairly. House Kessling would never... Cousin! Did they 
hurt you any. It seems our time is up. Noah, are you all right? You made it! Why didn't you flee with the others? I have a nasty habit of investigating my employers. And I'm pretty damn sure House Groom doesn't have a secret passage. You're the distraction. You did it to save everyone else. Then I ask again, why are you here? You could have treated us like pawns, but you never did. That kind of loyalty deserves to be paid an equal coin. Besides, you look like a lady with one last trick up her sleeve. Milady? Is he here already? Oh, heavens, but I applaud his efficiency. We meet again, Miss Groom. I don't recall seeing you on my calendar, Your Grace. <laughs> Ever proud, aren't we? I thought we might take this moment to discuss our future relationship. Are you about to propose, you cad? <laughs> Sadly, I am already married. However, if you are willing to reassess our other relationship, I will permit you to keep your status, your wealth, and this manner. A generous proposal, don't you think? You want me to join the Empire? To join you? What happens to the other League states? Their age has concluded. What concern is it of yours? I see you for the brilliant mind you are. Swear fealty to me, and the entire League will be yours. Oh, now we're talking. My offer pleases you. Oh, it's very bold. And it makes my skin crawl. A life of luxury beneath your heel? I'd sooner get down in the mud with the other soldiers and fight you to my dying breath. How dare you speak to his grace that way? Enough, Chapel. You impugn my honor, young lady. A fine jest to speak of honor. The Emperor of Galdia still draws breath, yet you carry yourself as if what's his is yours. <laughs> that is one opinion. Now, if you'll excuse me, I believe we're done here. You cheeky. <laughs> oh, but you are a fiery young woman. To choose sleeping in some barracks instead of the Empire's finest silks. Show Miss Periel to the gates. And if any man lays a hand on her, I'll have his head parted from his shoulders. I can see myself out. Oh, milady. Your grace, how can you... It's just a woman and an old man. They pose no threat. Mark me well, dukes. The day will come when this woman erases the triumph from your face. That is a promise. Until then, I bid you farewell. We guided the surviving soldiers back from the mines. 
There were a few stragglers lost in the tunnels, but I don't think we missed anyone. Good work. But where is her ladyship? You don't gotta worry about a tough piece of leather like her. Besides, Sabine's there to keep her safe. gonna do now what about you Noah you gonna head back to your village those Imperial scumbags drove us out of our home like common bandits which we are <laughs> wait really nah it's a load of crap but all they needed was a pretext and they got one her ladyship's suspicions were sadly accurate we need no further confirmation of Dukes Aldrich's territorial designs than the army he commands. Okay, but the other nations of the League are gonna help us, right? Right? It is pretty to think so. But the Dukes is a crafty man, and he may attempt to frame the war as a limited dispute between the Empire and Groom. If he is successful, our allies may hesitate. <laughs> Agreed. They ain't gonna stand up to Galdea until the fires of war are burning on their doorstep. They'll pretend not to hear, while the Empire sharpens its knives and prepares to take another slice of the continent. <sighs> Alright, so what do we do? I mean, we clearly can't go back to Elta's vice, and I loved it there so much! <laughs> <laughs> I know, dear. Listen up, everyone. There's something I need to tell you. Her ladyship bade you raise a resistance army? Yeah, cousin! Let's do it! We can't let those imp vermin march around our home like they own the place! So there's a chance we can get it back! <sighs> what do you want to do, kid? Sure, the lady asked it of you, but that don't mean you're obligated. Uh. It's just until she rejoins us. Well... If that is her ladyship's wish, I won't object. Let's go raise an army. Noah, you will serve as our provisional leader. Me? But... Come on, man! Have some confidence! Strut! Obviously, her ladyship saw something in you, or she would have asked someone else. We've got your back, cousin. That's right. <laughs> the resistance, huh? Yeah, I like the sound of that. Still. 
These ruins will require serious work if we're going to station an army here. Morning, Noah. How'd you sleep? Cause I feel like I got hit by a wagon. Emir's been working us like dogs all week, and these scrawny arms are really not made for heavy lifting. You said it's to make sure everything is ready for Lady Periel. Guess it's his way of worrying. Anywho, everybody's gathered in the Great Hall. Wanna go see what all the fuss is about? The Lord! Uh, yeah, this isn't the... What took you so long, cousin? You're our leader, remember? No sleeping in! Provisional leader. Just until her ladyship returns. Yeah, well, I think he's doing great. Yeah, <laughs> poor Noah. You got a lot of folks to please. For the past week, I tasked all of you with converting these ruins into an acceptable headquarters. However, there is still much to be done. Oh, please, no more physical labor. I'm so much better at flexing my mind. At least the soldiers have a place to sleep now. Mm. Uh, it won't be as fancy as my inn back in Elda's Vice, but I'll make sure everyone gets decent meals. And I'm still combing the mines for any soldiers we missed. If I may, there are a few people I'd like to introduce. The name's Gakto. Emir expressed interest in building a town here. And when I smell profit... Ah... Uh, I mean, when I smell justice against an oppressive empire, then I say, sign me up. Anyway, one long-term goal is to set up a local guild. I'll keep you posted. I am Iris, an architect and former professor at the University of Carl, who has long dreamt of designing a town of my own. Much to my delight, Emir reached out and has given me the chance to put my skills to use on your behalf. If you find yourself in need of a new building, I am your lady. The University of Carl? Very impressive, Miss Iris. Hello, I'm Kane. Gokto introduced me. I manage your warehouse. If we want our new town to flourish, we'll need countless resources and a place to stash them. That's where I come in. I've never had to look after a whole town's resources. You mind taking me on as an apprentice? Certainly, young lady. There's a lot to learn, but you look like you can keep up. Thank you all. Yet while we've achieved the bare minimum of infrastructure, we must strive for more. It's not just the facilities that are lacking. We need people. Fair enough. Can't call ourselves an army if it's just nine folks and a couple of pitchforks. I've been nosing around Eltisvice and the neighboring villages. Imps are still there, but their patrols are getting sloppy. 
We might be able to do some recruiting. Then let's hop to it! Bigger headquarters, more comrades, onward and upward! But if you don't mind me adding to the pile, cousin, there's one more matter you gotta tend to. Dare I even ask? It's fine. What is it? You gotta name this castle. Can't keep calling it the ruins or the castle or whatnot. That ain't gonna impress no one. Now that's an idea I can get behind. Think carefully, man. This is one of those watershed moment dealies. A name for the castle, is it? Very well. Dazzle me with your creativity. to agree. Flawless execution, cousin. Well, I suppose that is a name. Oh, now then, if we are to stage an actual resistance, we must grow our numbers. An army is only as strong as its people, after all. Going forward, you should seek out as many new comrades as possible. And you might not have to go far to find them. We'll give it our best, right, everyone? Noah, I took the liberty of putting together a little town development plan. Would you care to take a look? It takes a lot to make a town, you know. Building the facilities we need will be hard enough, but we'll also have to find the right people to run them. mood, are we? for supplies are a given, but fields and farms would be nice too. If our population grows, we'll also need some entertainment. You can use this development tree to keep track of our progress. It'll be tough finding the right materials and the right people, but I'm sure that growing our town will make the Alliance stronger in the long run. So, you'd best get to it, yes? together, so feel free to leave your junk with us. We'll watch it like hawks. Goods, right? Leave it to me. See you. 
What'll it be? See ya. I'll go ahead and line my pockets.